Very, very happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> hey everybody, hello and welcome to the third anniversary of Secret World Legends. Or as I just mostly can say, the secret world. I mean, come on. The, the, the secret world, when I stream next week, will be celebrating the bigger anniversary of our secret world IP that some of us really, really love. And so I am excited to go in and celebrate that it's still here because it could be worse. It could be gone. And there are anniversary things to do. There's the in-game anniversary stuff. There's the normal gifts to get. And I have someone here with me who can start telling you all about all the amazing megaversary stuff that's going on. So, yay! Thanks for joining us, Hikari. And I guess we should go in and uh, start bashing some bees in the head. <laughs> yeah, I'm like going to write my stream post. I'm like, <laughs> how many of you <laughs> celebrate three-year-olds with a baseball bat? There, did that click okay? And why is it not showing? I don't know, it went dark. Yeah. Technical difficult. See, it says it's supposed to be right on. I don't understand. Oh. It's flopping between the DXs. I, uh, yeah. Got it. Got it. We're here. I, oh, crud. I'm afraid to look. Oh, look, I have two open slots. I'm totally good. Totally good to get my login rewards today. Oh, what is that? Polymorphic glyph exchanger? <gasps> really? Yeah, it basically lets you pick any red glyph you want. It's pretty crazy. Oh, does it have to be red to start with? Yeah, that's. I think that's like the top. So yeah, that's what you get. Well, I mean, when it converts a glyph, does the glyph originally have to be red to be converted? No, th this, it's confusing what it says. It's actually this item, you just click it and it gives you whatever one you choose. It brings up like a menu and you just pick the one you want. Wow. That's pretty sweet. Yeah, I should probably put on a birthday outfit. I'm still wearing Valentine outfit. Ah. Uh... Let's give a weapon something. Here we go. Let's give my claws a little bit of help here. Or wait, I need to get another claw up so I can move this one to blue, so then I can get it to purple, so then I can get it to gold, so then I can trade it with... Yeah. Let's just go ahead and do this. <laughs> Never mind. That's the easier version. <laughs> oh, so... Ooh, I've got... A talisman one. Who do I want to... Oh, we'll totally do the helm. Critical empowerment results. Ooh, nice. I still have so much I need to do. So much I need to do. Sweet. So now, I don't think tonight there's anything scheduled. I think there was something at 7. Wasn't there a radio show at 7 tonight? Um... Or is that next... Why don't I just link everybody the uh, <laughs> Honestly, calendar. tonight's schedule is a little weird. I, I, I'm not sure if they're doing the... Um, I'm not sure if they're doing the story night time right now or if they're doing it later. I think that's tomorrow. But yeah, oh, that, that wasn't today on the schedule. Yeah. Oh my goodness, I hope it's not. Then I would have completely missed it. I mean, yeah, because I actually had, um, I have commitments tomorrow. Tomorrow's a special family holiday. So tonight, the 26th, yeah, oh, the RP and game event is the 28th. So that should be Sunday. Shambhala is tomorrow. A bike race tomorrow. 
Oh, I got one of these out of order. Unless I misprinted the story night. Let me get in here and make sure. Did I misprint the date? No, it says today 8 to 11. Oh, you know what? That's why it's listed right there. Because it is supposed to be the 26th. Huh. I, I don't know. I swore that that was... Yeah, so I think they might be doing that right now. Yes, that would be so cool to go check out. I was trying to schedule a stream around something, but my time is a little more limited. So, oh gosh, where do we go? I gotta go look at the post. <laughs> uh, of course, I probably need to hit some candy just because... I don't think I have my bat anymore either. All right. I'm trying to find and send. All Let's right. See. Meet local bees. Story night in character. Rules. Sharing. Wow, this really doesn't give a location? It's right here by the uh, animal well. You can meet up on me. It's in New York. In New York. You know, one of the weirdest things when I lived um, closer and was out east was going into New York City with my daughter and going to where the spot is in Secret World. It's like, cool. Yeah. Oh, it was here from that picture. Oh, sweet. Yeah, this is the uh, the story night. This is an ongoing RP event that they do normally, um, but this is a special one for the Megaversary. Um, it is in character RP stories, but they do allow um, people to just come and you know share a story or a message if they want. It doesn't necessarily have to be in character, but that's generally what they do. Sweet. It looks like they're just starting. I really should have changed her before coming. Might need to sneak her out for a moment and... <laughs> Go hide behind, hide behind the shack over here. Get changed into something more appropriate to her. <laughs> oh gosh! All right. Usually I do B logo stuff for the anniversary, so we're gonna do that, even though it's not normally something Angelica would wear. <laughs> Oh! Oh my goodness! I didn't realize Andrew played uh, Secret World. Baron Smeedy Pants. Okay, this doesn't necessarily look good with her red hair, but... Alright, let's pick out some good shoes. Need some anniversary shoes here. Cowboy boots. Hmm. 
All right, no, just for fun, we're going to wear some animal slippers because no one's supposed to know. <laughs> no one's supposed to know her for real. Right? Yep, only one server, so you can just... Alright, we don't just remove. She doesn't need any sunglasses. Oh, put your weapon away. Put your weapon away. What are you doing with your weapon? Crud. Put it away. Um, just turn on sprint. Yeah, most of her real wardrobe is actually um, very dark and formal and professional. <laughs> yes, come to New York or meet up. Um, you can click on... Oh, yeah. Well, what? Or, yeah, if you... I don't remember the meetup slash command. I'm going to move the chat up a little bit so I can read this. Yeah, add Hikari to your friends list and then hit meet up there. Yeah, M MU means meet up, just in case. Is this black one what the this year's anniversary t-shirt was? Yeah. Yeah, with the be. three, I see it. Oh, I guess I could. could read them out loud for her so that people in chat can hear something. <laughs> Incien. I may not be pronouncing her name right. Good evening, folks, and welcome to Story Night. I'll be hosting, and y'all know my name about now. One of the things that the Council of Venice has told us in that is that everything is true. Stories have impact and are important to our culture and reality. Truth is, we are all part of the story of this age, and our knowledge and wisdom should be passed along to everyone in order to preserve it. Most of you have heard my spiel already, but I do want to touch upon the rules as I always do. Please raise your hand if you wish to share a tale. When you're done, take your seat and we'll let another go next, or I can tell if folks are shy tonight. <laughs> or I can tell one if folks are shy tonight. I ask that our audience be respectful of whomever has the floor. Give them your full attention. Also request... And my... Weapon thing is right over the top of that. No fighting or weapons be drawn. <laughs> she says after I already accidentally draw my weapons. <laughs> you can drag the, the chat window around. Oh, there we go. We'll just make it go up a little bit. So we'll be here for a few stories or a story or two. And we'll also run and check out bee bashing. And oh, wait, at the start of the hour, we still have uh, the anniversary gullums. Hikari is showing up as offline. Hang on, I'm just going to group him. All right, I'm on your friends list. And as soon as you accept a group invite, you can meet up on me from the group.
played a little during Steam launch. Have a baby Templar. No one I knew was. Oh man, no, no! You have so much that you can still experience and. Oh yeah, you you want to come play, Toaster? All right. For us Gaians, it's been three years since our world's gone a little topsy turvy, and that makes this our third anniversary tonight. Let's together gather together to celebrate each other and tell our tales. The more boisterous, the better. In between the stories, we'll have story breaks. The council has given me some random prizes to give away to celebrate this occasion. I'll draw some random raffles out of the participants and then pass along the goodies. Hey, stories and prizes. I mean, that's not terrible. See, do, do you think she's fitting into the crowd now? <laughs> oh, the old Cthulhu chibi like fate. Yeah. Maybe I'm not blending in as well with my slippers, but. Yeah, no one no one suspects she's she's a professional assassin, right? Totally blending in. <laughs> Out of character. Also, as a reminder, using stage say and act will extend your emote and save ranges to accommodate a larger area to be heard. Oh! I actually did not know that. <laughs> now, if I had Emmy over here, I could probably make her give some kind of weird <laughs> story. In fact, I should have brought Emmy instead. Emmy Goldenbutt, man. That would have been a better flamboyant character to, to bring along. Now, how often would you say that they do a story time? I want to say every couple weeks, or it might be monthly. I don't think they do it weekly. But they do them quite a few, quite a bit. Steps back away. Yeah, everybody's Easily. just going back a little bit more. They know I'm streaming, darn it. <laughs> no, they don't, but. Thank you. 
Actually, as far as role play, it would be so completely out of character for her to get up and tell a story that I'm having trouble getting my brain wrapped around trying to do it. I want to support this group. Maybe I should just change logging and maybe I should just log over to another character. And she like shows up in the same outfit. What? We don't see anything. <laughs> Nobody's wanting to say anything. They're camera shy. <laughs> like I could tell a story about a Twi'lek and a Wookiee. Oh, I'm trying to see if I can come up with a story on the spot. Um, <laughs> I totally thought this was tomorrow. Um, yeah, I think she's gonna do one of her own, but it's another character. Oh, you know this one? <laughs> no, that's what she said. I just realized... Is that character's... Oh! Okay. For a moment, I'm like, is he referring to me? No. We're both named Angelique. <laughs> yeah. Uh, they're... And he's saying angel, but I'm like, that's not spelled like my angel. I'm kind of confused. Oh, wait! <laughs> yeah, they're a married couple. They've been playing since, like, 2012. Yeah, oh, no, I, I get that. I And I figured that. But I just, I laugh because yeah. he kept, somebody kept making, you know, references to Angel and I'd be like, what? What? <laughs> I don't know any of you people. <laughs> hmm. I was in, looks a little uncomfortable pulling out a small in, set of index cards, muttering something about body. <laughs> oh, dear. Wait a minute, this family stream, am I going to have to... <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> the only way to save yourselves is to tell a story. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Um, as a writer, I have a bajillion stories in my head, but what would, what could I tell here? Yeah, what would work for this? <laughs> I know, I'm like, ah! Like right now, actually, all my old Star Wars Galaxy stories are are like flowing through my head, and I'm having trouble pulling out of that. I mean, not that Star Wars doesn't exist in this, you know, because it does. There are probably Wookiees somewhere too. Phil Guberman's tale titled. 
Fondled by the filth evolved hyperparasitoid. Oh. Oh dear. Um, maybe actually I shouldn't. Uh, <laughs> I mean, not. <laughs> uh, see, is there a way I can hide chat? We'll just hide chat down here. Oh, wait, no, it shows up on the screen. Yeah. I want to stay in support, but. <laughs> uh, I'm sure that's fine. <laughs> Maybe I should go grab. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm like, I'm trying to read it offside first. The streets. The streets were glistening in the slick wetness of the Kaidan rain. She stood there, looking up at... something. I don't know. Her body was probably hot once. Maybe. I don't know. Um, yeah. <laughs> but she had one of them business skirts on. The kind, really sexy, unpowerful woman that made... <laughs> yep, okay. <laughs> I can't do this. We're done. <laughs> All right. I think this is awesome. I'm excited for them doing this. Um, if I was not... Um... <laughs> I'm, I'm on a family-friendly yeah. channel. So someone raises a brow at the title of the story, hands her children copies of some books featuring a Karen. <laughs> uh <laughs> oh we can go do other stuff. Wait, was there like seriously not a single? So there's gonna be some interesting stories going on. No prizes for MJ, sadly. Something about tentacles and arms. Well, uh... <laughs> I suppose I could have just anima welded out of there. Um... <laughs> oh no, she was maybe hot once. Do you have a minute? Like, really? <laughs> just sit here and be like, hmm. <laughs> but definitely go out if you, you know, you're free and... You know, also watching the stream, want a story at the same time? Yes! Definitely. People feel... Oh, wait. Let's not bring up the chat yet. <laughs> the stories take time to... Because they're text, they take time to push out. So you can kind of do two things at once. Oh, yeah. Let's Agartha it here. <laughs> oh. Oh, boy! Oh, <laughs> boy! Oh, wait, I totally forgot the New York entrance. Oh, that's hilarious. I've used my- oh my goodness. There's a lore here I haven't gotten. I have used the anima teleports for streaming so much lately. <laughs> Wait, this goes down to the Illuminati. I don't want to go to the Illuminati. I'm not Illuminati. I'm about to portal conduit out of here, man. Should be right through the side, the door. This way. Yeah, you go up the stairs. Okay, yep. I'm used to being on my Illuminati, so I'm just like, let me just run right down into the Illuminati. Let's go bash ourselves some stuff. We'll be ready for a 
<laughs> See, the best thing to do when you're doing a story night too is to have it written out. You can still copy and paste in, right? Yeah. And yeah, just get to do it. Just yeah, like when I'd run way. events and stuff. Yeah, you want to make sure you have all that text ahead of time. Come on, what's more B than a, a B? Are you arms extra long? I'm confused and scared. All right, let's grab ourselves. You need three inventory slots for that. Oh, shucks. Well, let's go see if there's room to throw anything in my bank. I have not inventory managed on her and I don't even know how long. <gasps> Andery! Do you have all the old... <laughs> Do you have all the old cosmetics? I love sharing cosmetics. Oh, nope. Everything is full. A hundred arm. I do not have a hundred arm. All right, let's see what we can get rid of. You have no idea. How old is your character? <laughs> we could really start some fun. Wonder what a holly hairpin looks like on a guy. Curl toad slippers, white. Uh, a pink heart watch? Surely you want a pink heart watch, right? Oh, so yeah, you've probably got all of these. Darn it. Oh, hey, let's open this up and. Shotgun. Ooh, do I have a shotgun I can use on? Faded Brawler's Belt. Why would I care about two Faded Brawler's Belts? I don't. Let's go sell those puppies. Gonna sell a Brawler's Belt. Gonna sell a Brawler's Belt. Soon as I can find it. There it is. Where'd the other one go? Fun thing is I could actually come back and just uh rebuy something if I need it. Alright, now let's go pick up the bat. Oh, I should be able to pick up the bat in here. Yeah, and things are going to drop when you use yep. the bat. So you need well, most of the candies and stuff, I mean, I've already got stacks of them, so that should work yeah. fine. Bash the bee! Smash the bee! Pound the bat right into its head! Festive candy chews! Now that I can move my chat up a little bit. Where are my festive candy chews? There they are. All right, your turn. Go for it. Oh, you got a crumpus one. <laughs> Unfortunately for me, I really have fun with the little... Oh, hey, just for fun. A 
should have waited. If anybody wants a sweetheart cake, have a bunch of those. Have some cake and eat it too. Oh, uh, oh, my Rosenbrawl access key. Wait, is that an empty slot up there? Oh, that's where the other belt was. Okay. Long woolen scarf red. I'm gonna see if Elf has a Alfredo. See, uh, see if he has a long woolen scarf red. No, I don't want to delete the item. I'm trying to give it to somebody. Take it, take it. Now smash the golem, bash the golem. Oh, anniversary flare guns. Those are something that I actually... Oh, I have a stack of 20. Yeah, we gotta use all these. We gotta use them all, everybody. <laughs> flare guns. Anniversary flare guns. <laughs> All right, how long until? So, <clears throat> so for the anniversary, the events that are going on are, oh yeah, I've got so many different things. Hey, we could go out and do a snowball fight. Hey, let's go out and do a snowball fight. You can bash pinatas, get candy if you eat. Is it just one of each candy? You uh. actually get... Is it one or is it? I think it's one. I think there's probably an achievement for eating them all. Yeah. Let me get achievements for. <laughs> Hasn't started yet. <laughs> Are they still doing summons over here? I still have some of my stuff. Ooh, 10 seconds. That person's not a target. Ah! Of course, you have to get enough to... I think all of my characters actually have... the achievements from this game. Running around in bunny slippers, having a snowball fight. Oh, thunk! <laughs> Good one, buddy. Yeah, they're actually having a, a Christmas in July event, or June event as well. Yes! Their presents and stuff. Yeah, involved Jimmy's in that one. giving away a whole bunch of icy claws and stuff like that. That's like one of his signature things. Yeah. I need to see if I can manage it. Icy claws, man. Oh, my target's moved out of range. Are we teaming up on him? Oh, thwack! Oh, no! You're teaming up on me! <laughs> 
Oh, one more minute. We both started at the exact same time, knocked each other down. <laughs> Five seconds. Ah, oh, moved at the last second. Ha. Eight seconds. Yeah. So the uh, the bike race is tomorrow. Um, I, it's, oh, there's several of them, but the first one is tomorrow. <laughs> Start with like two ish. Two thirty, I believe. Yeah. They, they they want you to be there like two twenty at least. So. Yeah, I, and be sure to check out the map because you got to stay on course. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. <laughs> Last year I tried to take pictures and I couldn't keep up. I'm gonna have to get a sprint upgrade. <laughs> <laughs> Can you, if you have a sprint upgrade, knock down to a lower sprint? Yes. I think I remember that. No, it's not. Wait. Wait, I yeah, thought that... P was. No, shift P is. Shift P, yep. Yeah, you can. If you have a, a faster speed, but your friends can't go that fast, you can. Yeah, go in here and just. Uh, sprint four is the max that they're allowing for the the race. Yes. All right. Look at all of these pets. All of these sprints. I have quite a few of them. Zebras, motorcycle. Oh, wanted to show people that one of the login rewards. Look at this coming up. A B motorcycle so the big things if you're interested in cosmetics the anniversary t-shirt and the B motorcycle for me let's see here we go the bumble scooter. <laughs> Vim. Vim. <laughs> All right, we're kind of killing time in nine minutes. We're going to get the This, this outfit looks so wrong on this character to me. <laughs> so the official things are mostly just the pinatas, the raid, the deep raid. You can still, I'm pretty sure you can still do happy feet. And uh, those various little gullum. Yep, and there's, uh, you, for when, one of the things you can get for running the, the golem raids is the shards that make the golems. So. Yeah, I have two. Um, but I own all the shems because I, I... Yeah, I had them all from, from TSW. Now, didn't they make us reacquire them here. Weren't the Shems one of the things that did not come over? Um, I remember that because that's why I fought so hard to do the raids the first time here because I was short, like 12 
golems because they did not transfer any of them and I was I was running on all three of my characters to get all the golems because I worked my butt off to get those golems in TSW because it was not as easy as doing this little insta raid, putting a shard together and getting one you didn't have. <laughs> and I don't recall. I don't recall um, actually like working for them here, but possibly. Yeah, it was all of these shards and I r had to run them to the point where when I clicked on them again, nothing happened because I'd had them all. Now, I still have over in Secret World, if any of you still have it installed like I do, I still have an entire character's bank filled with more than a hundred bags from the golems. I would run those things like crazy in order to um, have them to get the pets, which is what I was after, and then to share and trade with friends and give to friends so they could get the pet. I was, I didn't, I was never very big into collecting pets, but I still have a lot of them. Because <laughs> you end up collecting them over the course of the plan for eight years. Yeah, I, I love them, so. really really need the red version of this outfit i am seriously campaigning on twitter for it you can only get it through uh community managers the this pet no this outfit I've got different pants on, but it's all the metal outfits, there's the, the black metal and the ex extra heavy metal, which is this one, and then the, uh, the savage metal, which is a red one, the, but the savage metal is only, only a community manager can give it to you. Oh, bummer, because that would be good for her. Yeah, I have, I mean, I have the gold ones that you had to get at you know, the golden weeks. Let's see if I can They're under the they're under the outfits, aren't they? Yeah. Maybe I should run in under the chipmunk suit. This is a pants. <laughs> yeah. The gaunt. Yeah, well, that's how the pants you were just wearing before. I mean, I They're think. From yeah, that's uh, how she got the other character that I streamed with and the, the Illuminati that I made. That's how she got called Emmy Goldenbutt. Is because I always wore those pants. Yeah, I've got. I think I've got some of the gold suit. I don't know if I have all of it. And then I have the platinum suit, which is the one I wear mostly. Wait. I don't remember the name of everything. The like the the suit suit is just like button up suit or something like that. Oh, my Arabian dreams from that. Uh, Cupid the Honey Thief? Um, just because of how funny that sounds, let's wear those sandals. <coughs> oh, there's yeah, my extra heavy metal boots. 
Wait, why are only the boots showing? Oh, there they go. Spunked spike shirt. Brutal pants. The button-up suit doesn't seem to be in here. Or at least... No, no, it was a tux. Something tux. Spy tux. Oh, this is the yeah, black yeah. ones, not the... But I I think they're just in the individual parts. Like the pleated tuxedo pants. Yeah, I think they're going to be in the pants. The spy tux one is here. There's a white and a red one that I apparently have never gotten, but the... So, yeah, Mod Warrior. To be fair, SWG was super popular when it went offline. No, Secret World has been... Yeah, hush. It's good. There we go. We'll go look like more of a fighter. Except what on earth armband am I wearing? Still something from Valentine's Day. And yeah, this game is definitely still around. It, it might be maintenance modey just a little bit. We're sitting here waiting for the... Ooh, it's going to open up in a second, so i got to hurry if I... Gloves. Oh, maybe I should... Oh, I think... Andrew left group. He didn't want to be group with us. I'm not in your group either. No, no. Never mind the gloves. We need to make sure we're in group. That way we can get in the same... I think there's a small chance we still won't end up in the same instance, but... Should. Oh, no. Now the group thing is showing up, so there he is. Here we go. Let's go beat things up. Every guild you join closes up within a week. Yikes! Yeah, I don't know what is with her armband. I do have a bandage on one arm. I mean, honestly, guilds in Secret World aren't a thing. They just, they just aren't. Because guilds are the only way to get free inventory space. Yeah, every so person has their own out. guild. Everybody makes their own guild. That's each of my characters has their own guild. Um, and I never gilded my private character. Or no, my private character had a guild, me and my friends. My public character never got gilded because I, I never want to do the, you know, oh, I'm favoring some group over others. Uh, and now it's just in Secret World Legends. Yeah, that's the only way to get better space is if you make yourself a guild. Usually you have a friend in it, and then... And it's how you can trade things with your alts. So it's also the only way you can trade things with your alts, so... You go in it, and you put a friend in it who doesn't have a gilded alt yet, and they bring your alts in, and then you go offline. They go off. Ooh, look, we have the Kaidan. Oh, crud, I do not have my weapon. That's what happens when you use the bat and you forget. Yeah, one of mine's unequipped, too. Yep. <laughs> oh, holy cow. Oh, I remember this guy on the streets of Kaidan. Tough! <laughs> Charge! Wait! No weapon! Retreat! Yeah. Oh my goodness, Bill, 104 and 107? Yeah, I'm not living where you're living, buddy. So everybody's all, don't you want to go south where it's, like, cooler? And I'm like, heck no! 
Northeast, baby. I am going to the snow. Although, to be honest, I really had planned on moving and settling out in, like, Oregon, Washington area. Turns out, nope. Nope. I am going back to the east. Easter year. Northern year, Easter year. Oh, I want to move to Alaska, that's for sure. That's one of the states I haven't been to, even though I have family that lives there. Give me the six months of night. I'm totally good with that. Six months of day would not be good for me, but... It's like, people have their... They live in the north during the, the summer and the south during the winters. I'm gonna be like, I need Alaska, North Pole during winter, go to South Pole during the summer. Do a melee when you're out of range, doofus MJ head. Mission received. Yeah, so yeah, then we after the uh, races, which should be fun. Those those are fun. If you've never seen those, they're they're pretty crazy. It's just they've got a like you say they've got a course that you go through, and uh, they they race, and it's pretty much just it's like the Kessel Run, right? Because everybody's running the same speed. It's a matter of getting there. The who? Shortest distance. Yeah, who cuts the corner just right? Who doesn't like me? I would turn around and start going the wrong way. All right, now every time you do this raid, guys, really quick, I want to let you know, and you don't really want to do it inside the raid, um, you get a buff that'll allow you to open one of these, and I almost never get anything in them because, uh, because I've, I've gotten everything, everything, there's nothing new this year, obviously, the very first one I open goes straight to Anima Shards. Um, if you do trade characters while you're inside there before you jump out, you can get two, maybe even three characters through the raid because it takes time to zone out, but if you just zone to character, zone, log to character select, and then come in and have your character right here, you can sometimes get all three characters in the raid before it closes. This raid only stays open for ten minutes. Two minutes after the hour to twelve minutes after the hour, it cuts. All right, let's open our bag. Oh, an irate shard. Another animated particulate. I wish I could, like, not get those because... That one looks nice and shiny. Is that... That's a silver shiny? Yeah, this is the platinum one. It, I guess it's silver, they call it now, but it was platinum when I bought it. <laughs> oh. I bought it in TSW, so. It's got a top hat and everything. But yeah, uh, tomorrow... We also have the concert, which is gonna, the radio show, which will be good. So that, that's, that goes like right after the race. That's with Happy Tunica Radio. That's the radio station I work with a lot. I don't think, I mean, I kind of want to jump on and get my other alt in there, but I don't need to. Yeah, there's uh, there's no... There's nothing I don't have, so... 
I, I'm not that in desperate need of shards. They have 68,000. I have 397,000. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, I sometimes like to get the uh, sh the little golems to help people run. Yeah, and the irate shard is like... That'll get... That's for happy feet, so... Yeah, so if somebody needs happy feet... Oh, look, see, someone's over here. Dude, I hate when the pets die like that. See, someone's already over here with an irate shard. Because it's like the most common one. Yeah, sometimes I get the rares, and then you really want to help people be able to get this deep raid. Yep. Let's see if this character has any other shards. Oh, no, I have the jerk, though. Oh, is it not gonna... Do they not work anymore? The Assault Automaton? Which one? There we go. Um, oh, I need... Do I... What? I need to point it at somebody or something? Yeah, the Assault Automaton kills other pets. I guess because there's no pets around. I can't, I can't even summon it. Oh, there we go. And I'm getting the summon circle. There we go. You can tell who he's modeled after? Irate shard. <laughs> but of course the irate shard is going to be the one that you get out of Kaidan. That's why it looks like Kaidan. Oh, did he already disappear? Wow, that was fast. Uh, I don't think he had any real targets to go for. So some of the some of the ways that it gets hard to do this is because there's a schedule of which golem shows up which hour. And there are yeah. 12 golems or are there 13. So you've got like you know these just certain hours that you can jump in and get it and each one has the chance of dropping the shard to do the full thing so then you'll have somebody who'll be need like the frozen one and psht, you know you know that's not coming up for another eight hours or something and yeah story still this place still has the best the best story i mean the most heartbreaking thing to me is the fact that the story is not completing, you know? And the, the crazy thing is, is that they wrote a whole bunch of story. Like, Josh wrote a whole bunch of story. The problem is it's all in the agents and the lore. So it it's hard. I don't have the desire to go playing the agent system to get all the story that he wrote. Yeah. No, I get that. I mean... Oh, I never did fix the... I keep going in to try to fix this Whatever's going on with her arms here. Hand has the candy jewel ring put on. See? Actually do have a candy ring pop, which I just ate one that looked exactly like that last night. That's kind of crazy. Oh, so what does it... Those don't actually belong to this shirt, do they? I don't recall seeing them with that shirt before. But what other... It kind of looks like it. 
Maybe they do. Oh, we could jump into an aerobics leotard. <laughs> this game has so many cool outfits. Um, as king, I think I will actually be moving farther away because I'm going way northeast. Maybe if I put a jacket on her, it'll look less weird. Angry Feet's Rioting Soul Jacket. <laughs> oh my goodness there we go now we're totally staying with that <laughs> it's all cool it's all cool <laughs> I feel like I need to jump into happy days <laughs> oh And so I'm, I'm getting messages from my daughter in Korea about some horrible work stuff that's been going on with her. She called home about yesterday for, um, and then, and then I have a friend also watching this, this Star Wars stream earlier and making fun of my bad combat skills. And I'm like, I never played combat. <laughs> Just be quiet. Leave me alone. <laughs> I'm gonna look like a total noob doing combat because I never did that. Do you want to talk about dances? Synchronizing some amazing routines? Man, I got you covered. <laughs> oh. Wow. I do have to say that it is phenomenally quieter this anniversary than it was last year. Ooh, I love that core. One of the panoptic, pen, panoc, pen, yeah. Uh, so yeah. last year though, last year's anniversary, we were still coming off of the fact that uh, we had gotten some new content with South Africa in 2018. So there was still there was still some hope I think back at that last anniversary. And so people that are here have all pretty much done everything like Akari, uh, like myself. Most people have done everything. So you're not going to find a lot of stuff randomly happening, but this community is also so good if you're yelling out I need help to get um uh, to do this deep rate, you know, get the happy feet or get the something. I mean, people will be like, oh, hey, I have this one and I have this one. I can help with this. So they are helpful, but you're not going to randomly run into it. And maybe more towards the end when people have some more. Because as you can see, they still want to raid. <clears throat> but so let's just start talking a little bit about all the different. Okay. Rawr. I feel very Wolverine-y now. Let's give... I mean, we've got a shout out. We've, we've already s said a little bit about the Megaversary. But the Megaversary is really the big thing that's going on right now. And for anybody who came in late, I'll throw in another link to that. So these are the different things that are going on. There's an the ARG event, but if people already solved it, that might be over not exactly sure it started on the 24th no it's it's been going on since the first anniversary so nobody solved it yet oh it hasn't been solved yet because it's like it go on and then depends how long it takes to solve so i'm like oh if it can solve in a couple days okay wow all right that's the same one going um yeah, they add new clues every year but the first bike race is tomorrow 
at 2.30 Eastern. Please meet a little beforehand. You're going to be in London. Now, you want to make sure you know the London route because if you deviate, you're, you're out, right? So check it out. It's there. There's a link. There's actually a picture of it right there on the stream post. You can see the route. Also on the 27th, Happy Tentacle Radio has a radio show starting at 4. And then I like the name of this one, um, Jimmy's Kill the Wabbit Rosenball event. <laughs> that one's on the 29th, so that'll happen on Monday. And basically every single day there are mega boss fights. Just look at the calendar. I actually started to list them all out, but there were too many. It, it looked really gross on the article to have... Yeah all of these dates and times listed out. So I'm just like, just see the calendar. Yeah, um, same with the Rosen Brawl. It's going like almost all the time, 24 hours a day, so. Oh, is it? I only saw it noted at that one time. So hey, yeah. you might get in some more. And yeah, of the course- the description of it is weird. But. You do these things and like certain people there, if he gets if he gets defeated, then somebody there is gonna get a, a reward. Yeah, the, the J Jimmy's part of it is all based on um, as many, if you kill him a bunch of times, he does raffles and stuff. It's going to be pretty cool. And then Leo has a, a similar Rosen Brawl event that might not be on here. Um, that again is just uh, fighting uh, constantly all the time. Um, there is something a little later in week two, I thought. Um, but this, I went off of, I, I double checked with the calendar the yeah. day it published. So more things can get added. Uh, blind yeah, exactly. <laughs> bad salient date contest. At first, I'm like a blind date contest. What the heck? It's eating the bad dates, and you eat as many as you can, and you go. I can't remember. I actually managed to go a long time with self healing. Or wait, do they say no skills when they say self healing? Are they meaning no skills whatsoever if you have a healing build? I, I think they just mean waiting until it kills you. Yeah, so based on your signets and stuff that'll activate. I don't think they allow any actual self-healing, but maybe they do. I'm not sure. Yeah, because when I did it, even with my self-healing, you know, you are you are booking it through those heals, man. You're like, Gee -gee -gee. and I'm trying to remember. I think I might have gotten to 18. I, I don't remember the number. It was on stream. So I'll just have to go back and look through all the streams and figure it out. Yeah. And the next week, we have... Um, starting on July 1st is when the week is starting. You've got the bike race sequel on the 4th at 5.30. So if you've, you've gotten yourself a little too much sun and stuff out in the uh, <laughs> celebrating any, if you celebrate July the 4th or Independence Day here in the U.S., then, yeah, if you're anywhere else, you can still celebrate July the 4th because it's everywhere. <laughs> Independence Day might only be here. Then uh, come race. Let's see how well you do. And you're with, you know, sunstroke and lots to drink and a million barbecue ribs and stuff in your stomach. There is the DJ Malik radio show on the third at seven. Oh, that's the one that I was thinking was tonight because of the third is a Friday, but I was on the wrong week. Fancy dress show. with Happy tentacle radio is on the fifth at seven. Wait. Is it really 7 a.m.? It's not 7 a.m. That's a typo on my end, isn't it? Uh, most likely. Pretty sure that's supposed to be... Let's see, because I can click right here. It gives you a link to every one of these things so that you can look at them, guys. Um, 1900. Yeah. What this? I'm like, a.m.? Some, somebody's going to show up a little early. <laughs> yeah, so... Uh, yeah, because we're doing the... Uh... The opening ceremonies basically tomorrow, and then the closing ceremonies, you know, on, on the fifth. And then Malik is doing his show in the middle. Nice. Malik used to be a DJ for um, Radio Free Gaia, but they closed their doors this year. So. Yeah, I remember Radio Free Gaia. Aww. Ah, okay. But let's not let's not do sad notes because I mean we've obviously got enough of those kind of from Star Wars, but Star Wars, <laughs> great. So uh, it says Secret World, Star Wars Galaxies Legends was on the 
stream before here, so it was on the list, and I kept looking at it and getting the SW Legends, and my brain was having so much trouble with, why is there another word there? What is Secret World Galaxies Legends? <laughs> and, then, and then I was like, wait, that doesn't say secret or world at all. <laughs> it says Star Wars. Yeah, guys, I'm not saying that my brain's not completely confused sometimes. Um... And all throughout the event, now this is something some of you guys might really want to be interested in. There are drawings, and most of these involve just sending a PM or an in-game mail. So you've got, you've got uh, Agent Boone. I mean, well, Boone Agent, anyway. Uh, Boone is, is one of the awesome characters. The first one you really come and see in Kingsmith outside of your faction stuff. Then Andy and Nicole duo, that's got to be an interesting agent. And other things, uh, contest the the song mashup. It's a very mega sequel, Merry Melodic Mars mashup. So if you like to <clears throat> change words to songs to fit a specific theme, I don't know anyone who likes to do that, then <laughs> you can send that in art raffle, book giveaway, art contest, and then people who've actually placed in the other contests and events, they're going to have a super winner as that. And of course, the people who have contributed to this, you've got Happy Tanical Radio, DJ Malik, Legio Fulminata, Jimmy the Rabbit, Leo Grimm, League of Monster Slayers, Oh boy, I'm going to butcher some of these names, so forgive me. Carafinon and Jack, um, Before Eve, Vormer and Icyan, that's who we just saw at Story Hour. Manga Spirit, Hikari, wait, who's that? Who's that? I don't know who that is. <laughs> don't know at all. Nakmak, Kailani, Hollow Point, Nine Swords, Veritas, The Zero Point Report, Bumblebread, Misa and Busilor. So sorry for butchering any of those names, guys, but that's who we have to thank for for these events and the things that are going on. And Funcom has provided some things to give away, like the agents. That stuff is coming from the devs, so we appreciate that. And I, I mean, I want to see more story. I liked that Moons of Madness exists. I, I really liked being able to see something from another point of view, you know, out on the moon. I thought that was really neat. And there are the unofficial books that have been officially sanctioned. So there's a little bit of more IP there. But I do want to see more of the stuff in game. Like, where was South Africa leading I mean, when you finish the story, you see a familiar face uh, before things, you know, end. And you're left going, wait, what? So I'd love to see where that goes. And I know they had this road mapped out for at least another season. And I'm glad the IP isn't dying. And I think I would be really sad if I wasn't able to jump into the world. Um, and especially if I can get a friend to join for the first time and run through with them, that would be really neat too. But, but this is one game. I mean, you've got a lot of games. You're like, I'm sad this game is gone. All right. I mourn Star Wars Galaxies leaving, but it kind of died out before the end anyway, because of a lot of the uh, changes in handling and a lot of my whole role play community kind of left so like the world I lived in kind of left <laughs> and it's not the same that way uh, but this is one of the other games where if it reaches the point where it has to go I'm going to be very sad because nothing comes close to what this game offers and even if it's not offering anything new for those of us who have been here for eight years now is it eight? Yep. Those of us that have been here for well, eight years, there's nothing really new to it. But that doesn't, it's like, oh yeah, well you've read that, but you've you've read Lord of the Rings online. There's, not Lord of the Rings online. Great, you can tell I work in MMOs. You've read Lord of the Rings, right? You've already read it, so there's really nothing more to it. We could just get rid of it, you know? 
No, because there are other people that could enjoy it, even if there is a beginning, middle, and end. So I'm glad that the game is still open in here. And because there is still such a good community of people. Now, I mean, I'm not saying everybody in the game is all unicorn and roses, okay? But there is such a good community that does continue to take time out of their lives to make things for people to do, to keep people engaged in the game and 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 that's pretty great too so I guess if you come to this game if I were to pitch this game to friends I'd be like come in it's it's a storybook come and live the storybook like a single-player game would with a beginning and an end don't even don't even think about the possibility that there could have been more because that's where all of us are having the pain right <laughs> not that the story sucked or anything is that we don't have more but if you can get people in and go, <coughs> this is the start, the middle, and, and the end. And it ends on a cliffhanger, so maybe there'll be a sequel. But come on, how many times? Like, we had only one season of Firefly. So, you'd think we'd be used to this by now, right? <laughs> maybe if we market it that way. It's a, it's, it's a multiplayer RPG. It really is what it is now. So, if you guys haven't played it, please give it a try. Unless you really can't stand horror. I do have a friend who has a serious problem with horror. And, and that is why he, he does not play the game and does not want to play the game. And I respect that. That's okay. Uh, there is the stream post. Guys, I want to hear how many of you out there are uh, Secret World vets? How many have played at any point since the secret world was released on july 3rd and that was back in 2012 so we are we are coming up on our eighth anniversary i i'm gonna tell you i'm still slightly resentful that they couldn't wait one week and let us get our fifth anniversary shirts from secret world before moving to secret world legends one week from getting a fifth anniversary shirt i mean they could have just made the shirt and given it to us to come over because come on fifth anniversary I totally feel cheated by that still three years later <laughs> still feel cheated <laughs> yeah the game has changed much from before launch to launch to Secret World Legends um, but this I mean I didn't do anything at the story time but this is just just rife with source material for so many stories and so many neat things so if you get a chance you can click on that link and you can actually click the play SWL button and then you can get in and start playing the game and you can get through it without friends or you can grab a friend or two and do it either way a lot of fun and of course you can also read up on the game can read up on other games lots of games did you guys know there are a lot of games out there I've heard tell that there's lots of games <laughs> massivelyop.com does cover them and of course if you're following Twitters and stuff like that you'll get notification when things are happening and the stream team calendar is there on the page huge thank you to everybody for coming and supporting us and I want to give a mega thank you to Hikari for coming in and talking with us some about the megaversary and some of the things that are going on because uh, and now's the time if you want an event to jump in on you can do that if you feel like you want to wait till Halloween that's also a good time to jump into secret world <laughs> I so help me they would make me so happy if they would bring the seven silences in they really would make me happy oh, maybe not forever but for a long time <laughs> hopefully you guys are having a safe and wonderful Friday night Sounds like a downpour just slammed on my house, so I think I need to go dance in the rain some. Have a great night, be safe, and I hope to see you all tomorrow, either in-game, on-site, or on-stream. Until then, take care.